Hello, my name is Kiara Saka. My name is Salvatore Saka. And we're brought here today to show the defect in this Trojan hand riveter. Unfortunately, our dad couldn't be present in this video today due to being in distress about the event that occurred with this riveter. To be honest with you, I think we're all going to be in distress after seeing this video. Uh, can I just say that it's absolutely appalling that Trojan have denied liability for the damages that the gun has caused, but have admitted to a design fault and yet still selling it to Australian consumers. We hope this video goes out to everyone and to see the dangers that this gun can cause. So just to be clear, Trojan are aware of the default, yet I was still able to buy this hand rivet gun this morning from Bunnings. And today is the 2nd of the 3rd, 2019 with the Trojan hand rivet gun. So I'll quickly run through the instructions and information on this packaging and then I'll explain where the fault in the gun is and then we'll run our testing in the video. So the packaging states Trojan hand riveter, multi-size head, no need to change the nozzle, 100 rivets with the sizes, tried, tested and lifetime guarantee. As you can see, comes with all the rivets, Trojan hand gun in there. Okay, now I'm going to read the back part. Okay, so Trojan hand riveter, how to select the correct rivet. Select rivet material based on strength needed, corrosion resistance and material to be joined. All steel, high strength when, using, when joining steel to steel. Aluminium, medium strength. Use with aluminium and where rust is a problem. Two, select rivet diameter. Large diameters create stronger joints. Three, select grip range based on thickness of the material to be riveted. Four, Use washers when joining soft materials like leather or when hole is oversized. Tried, tested, lifetime guarantee. Instructions. Rotate the head to select the right position for the 2.4 millimeters, 3.2 millimeters, 4 millimeters or 4.8 millimeter rivets. Insert rivet into rivet gun. Three, position rivet gun. Four, squeeze handles. Five, ejector spring will automatically eject rivet mandrel when handle is released. Lifetime guarantee. Cyclone Tools guarantees this product will be free from defects in workmanship and materials for the lifetime of the purchaser of the product customer. If a defect in material or workmanship becomes evident during that period, Cyclone Tools will, at its option, either replace the product or refund it to the customer the purchase price paid by the customer for the product. In the event of such defect, the products should be returned to the place of purchase together with proof of purchase for replacement or refund. Any handling and transportation and other expenses incurred in claiming under this guarantee are not covered by the guarantee and will not be borne by Cyclone Tools. The obligation of Cyclone Tools under this guarantee is limited to the circumstances set out above and is subject to the product not having been altered, tampered with, or otherwise dealt with by any other manner other than intended respect of the relevant product, and the product not having been used or applied in a manner that is contrary to the customer, customary usage or application for the relevant product or contrary to any stated instructions or specifications of Cyclone Tools. In addition to other rights and remedies that may be available under law, our goods come with guarantees that cannot be excluded under Australian consumer laws for customers in Australia and the Consumer Guarantees Act for customers in New Zealand. If you're a consumer in Australia, you are entitled to a replacement or refund for major failure and compensation for any other reasonably forceful loss or damage. You are also entitled to have the goods repaired or replaced if the goods fail to be of acceptable quality and the failure does not amount to major failure. If you are a customer in New Zealand, we comply with our obligations to you under the Consumer Guarantees Act. And it just has pictures to use. Gloves, eyewear and so forth. With manufactured in China, Cyclone Tools. Uh, level 1 Doncaster Road, Victoria, trojanstools.com. There you go, there it is. So I'll just go and explain where the default is in this gun today. So it's in this screw mechanism here. So you obviously place a pop rivet into the front. It's got a spring mechanism here. Pressure is applied and the rivet will come out through the back part there. 
There's no safety stopping this every time it comes on loose, every time a pot rivet is put in. That little screw mechanism there. So you're practically aiming it at your own head, I'm firing it at your own head when it comes to the last thread of the screw. And it does happen with velocity due to the spring being in there as well. So we'll prove that today in our video. So children have stated to us that they are not liable for the damages the gun caused due to the fact that the screw being tight when it sold to us. Today I did go and buy two guns just to prove that some do have the screw tight in when bought, if you can see that back. Screw there is pretty tight in there, right? But if we have a look at this one, this one here is almost ready to be shot. If we just have a look at that, that screw is already half out. Um, that will only need a couple rivets to be shot into someone's head pretty much. And these packets have not been opened at all or tampered with. They are fully closed. Just have another look at that <coughs> screw in there is ready to come out with velocity behind it. Okay, so now we're gonna open the Trojan hand movement gun. So we have our hand rivet gun there. We have hot rivets. We come in it. So we've got obviously the larger hot rivets, smaller ones. Our packaging we'll just leave to the side over here. Okay, so now we're going to put gloves on. <coughs> and our glasses as well. Safety first. So today we're going to be putting pop rivets into this mechanism here and this will show we will show um, the screw coming loose every time we do it okay so we'll do a few of these first so I'll put pop rivets in so just watch out when you do this you come on this side and do this one yep. and I'll put the pop rivets in for you please make sure that that is facing that way because it would my fire at any time <coughs> Okay, so push the gun in like that. Put it onto the biggest one it is on, yep. And the big top rivets we'll use up first. Okay. And we'll just have a look at, oh, there we go, the back screw coming loose slowly as we're doing it, or we'll keep doing it until it does pop off to the last one and show you there. So it's about 20 rivets in and the screw at the back coming undone. Okay, and we've done about 30 now. So, done about 30 now into the gun. 
can see the leftover hot rivet things we have and the screw at the back coming unloosened every time and let's just say on the packaging it doesn't state to tighten up the screw or anything like that so we're getting to the end here yep. so it will shoot out soon so Tori just watch out here yep. we'll make sure we're not in the way of it okay Point it away Point it away from yourself because it is it is a weapon Hopefully it's still coming undone here. Can I just show you? it is to unloosening it every time look at that look at that it's ready to be shot it's just waiting okay keep going there we go show these ones small ones Velocity straight through that. You don't even know where it went. And if that hit your head, and that was just a small pot river, too, that wasn't the big that one. Was a small one. The so big imagine ones, aiming that towards your head. The big ones make much more of a bang. So Trojan um, stated that we don't have enough sufficient evidence. I think the sufficient evidence is in all 14,000 of the guns sold Australia wide. So these rivet guns aren't a tool, they are a weapon. Have a look at that. The screw has popped off the back there. Spring has come out. That would have created velocity inside, like that. Creating velocity as he went to put pressure on it. And I don't even know where the screw piece went, to be honest with you. So, thank you for watching. So to conclude our video today, I think we did establish that the gun um, has a default to it and the spring would have created velocity as it came out like that. He would have put pressure on it like that and it would have just sprung out the screw, which we can't even find now. It is somewhere around this room. So we're very disappointed that the, um, about the complaints handling system that was in place, number one. Number two, with the service we've received and the denial of the faulty product from Trojan, okay? Um, they stated we don't have enough sufficient evidence to back our case. 
Well, I think the evidence is in all 14,000 guns that you've sold Australia-wide, which you did state to us. So these rivet guns aren't a tool, they are a weapon. And if you own one of these, I highly suggest you bring it back to the nearest place you purchased it from because they are dangerous. Thank you for listening.